in many of our churches we regard unbelief as a kind of harmless weakness well I don't believe but after all does God really expect me to the New Testament doesn't call unbelief a harmless weakness it calls it a sin and when we see that we're ready to get rid of unbelief and to open the way through believing God to receive what he has for us I want to read from Hebrews chapter 3 verse 12 and 13 and this is addressed specifically to Christians beware brethren lest there be in any of you an evil heart of unbelief in departing from the living God but exhort one another while it is called today lest any of you be hardened through the deceitfulness of sin you know it is what the writer calls unbelief he calls it evil and he calls it sin 